Our next award category is Agribusiness, Food and Beverages. Now, this award is for outstanding international success in the field of manufactured foods, beverages and agricultural products. To present the award is Combank's General Manager for Working Capital, Business Lending, Elizabeth Huxley. Commonwealth Bank, also a gold sponsor and have been sponsors of the Australian Export Awards for 35 years. Another incredible commitment to the program. And we invite Elizabeth to the stage. And while she's coming up, let's meet this year's Agribusiness Food and Beverages finalists. I'm delighted to be here to present the Agribusiness Food and Beverage Award on behalf of the Commonwealth Bank. Combank is privileged to support Australian exporting businesses and I would like to recognise and congratulate all the finalists here tonight. The winner is Frosty Boy Global. Wow, this is um, really a big surprise. We, um, last year we were exporter of the year in Queensland, and we came to Canberra with full expectations and nothing happened. Um, <laughs> so we're very happy to be here tonight and uh, to have this celebration with us. Uh, we, I can also claim we supply to the military as well, but it's a beverage like soft serve. Um, so we've been going since 1976. Um, export started in around about 2001. Started slowly. Um, on this stage, we have supplied to about 76 countries, and we do about an average two million serves per day all over the world. So it's mainly QSRs, that's our customers. So we do mainly soft serve and other beverages, um, hot cocos, chocolates, those kind of things. It's all powder-based, so it's easy to manufacture in, in Queensland and then put it in containers and ship it all over the world. So that's Frosty Boy. I wanna, can I just thank quickly thank Austraid and obviously TIQ as well, that they helped us open up doors all over the world. So um, without them, it's impossible to achieve what we did. And we brought the whole table tonight of the team of Frosty Boy, so um, I want to thank the whole team. Um, the few you on the stage, but also the people there at the back and everyone that didn't make it tonight to, to a camera. It's a, it's, as we always say, it's a group, it's, it's a group thing. It's a, no one can do it single-handedly to achieve this, from the R&D that create the products to the guys that load the containers, the whole chain in between. So thanks to all the team at Frosty Boy and well done to all. Thanks. All right, I don't know how I became your photographer. But let's get a selfie with everyone in the background, anyhow. There you go. All Thank right. You, um, hey, Frosty Boy, great brand name, and it sort of goes back for years, doesn't it? Is there an export market that you're in at the moment that you look back and go, I never thought we'd be exporting to there? And, and how did it come about? Come up well, the fact that we export to 76 countries is difficult to pick one. Yeah. Uh, as um, the minister said earlier, Southeast Asia is our biggest market. Uh, Philippines, Malaysia, Indonesia, but we recently started to, to grow in, uh, in Africa and UAE as, as well, so the Middle East. Um, yeah, so uh, everywhere is a surprise, I suppose. And, uh, uh, and I was reading you're in Nigeria now. Yes, exactly, there as well. Oh yeah. my God, that's amazing. Wherever we can, we go there. Good on you. Congratulations <laughs> you. again.